Then I will turn it over to uh, Governor Stevens, who is the chair of the personnel committee and wants to make a report for that committee. Yes, thank you, uh, Executive Director and Mr. President. I just wanted to uh, uh, tell the board that at the September meeting, uh, the, per the personnel committee will be presenting for your approval uh, the uh, elements for uh, the evaluation of the executive director for FY23. Um, one of the things I want to let the personnel committee know is we will uh, hopefully have a quick meeting um, next week. And I think something may have already gone out to all of you. And that regard that's regarding uh, the goals for the executive director. But just to give you all a heads up what's up, um, we're putting things in place uh, for our our uh, processes for doing the executive director evaluation for the fiscal year. Uh, we had adopted the goals that had been suggested, uh, but we did that at our last meeting. And um, I would, uh, having some more communication, uh, it would not be appropriate to have those as goals for FY23, since we just adopted that, but instead uh, consider those goals or goals for FY24 that we would also adopt at the September meeting so that when the new fiscal year comes in, the executive director has the full year to work toward accomplishing those goals. So that's just kind of a heads up. The other thing I want to point out is since we are, uh, as we have said our policies would be, uh, evaluating the executive director uh, for uh, each fiscal year, if you recall, last time we had an 18-month um, uh, evaluation, and now we're getting back to the 12 months. But one of the things about that is that um, governors, who, governors and officers who would have left the board uh, but who had been on the board during that entire fiscal year um, need to be a part of the evaluation. And that's something that the personnel committee is also suggesting to you, as well as the elects who will become uh, part of the new board. And so we just want to um, actually finalize that process. Uh, the, uh, the governors and officer who have left um, will be a part of the evaluation team, but will not be a part of the discussion then by the board when the results are in. That's really a matter for uh, the existing board. Um, and only if by your decision you want to invite either um, myself for whatever reason or someone else, that's, that's your decision to make with advice from general counsel. But generally, since that is an executive um, session uh, determination, uh, those of us who have been off will be a part of the evaluation, but not necessarily the final assessment by the Board of Governors. So that information will be uh, provided for you for action at our September meeting. Any questions? Thanks much. Thanks, Helen. 